update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial trading up 146, NASDAQ up 116, S&P's up 22, gold. Gold contract up $7.90, trading at 2055 an ounce. We have silver up uh, flat, uh, $24.64 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 44 cents. $73.78 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note down three ticks, 112.21. 30-year down 13 at 123.31 in King Dollar. King Dollar is down 555 ticks, 101.853. That's on its way to 99. Euro is at 109. Yen's trading 142. The British pound is at 126 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&Ps, folks. Bottom line is that, uh, you know, you get a market that's going to grind higher once again. So we'll see how this shakes out. You got the sell down yesterday. I'm going to talk about that as soon as I get on the air today. Uh, bottom line is that uh, we're down fast and furious yesterday. You're pumping up a little today. We'll see what we can do tomorrow. And then, of course, uh, coming into next week. That's on the SPY as well as the NDX100. And then, you know, when we talk about one-day options, man, because that's what we're going to be talking about here on that trade, is that uh, January 8th, folks, okay, one-day options, are going to be coming into the Russell 2000. Uh, now, on the S&Ps, they got them expiring every day, and the Russell 2000. But this is how they started on the S&Ps. It's going to be Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So more volatility is going to be coming in the market, that's for sure. Gold. Gold contract. We take a look at the gold contract. What you have out here, gold wants higher price. Dollars lower. Gold wants higher price. You got uh, 110,000 contracts. You need, we need more contract volume to break this consolidation of the last six days. And you go into King Dollar. King Dollar's got a, you know, a pricing problem and it can't hold price. You're in the lower range right now and you're coming down with some conviction out here today. You can see this, you know, we're coming down, nothing's stopping this thing, you know. So I suspect when we get back, you know, yeah, I suspect that by the second week of September, man, we're going to be down at the 99 area. It's not that far away. We're at 101, 850 right now. So, um, that's where that's where that's looking. And notes and bonds, they still want higher price, lower yield. You know, you have you have the 10 year right now. It's going in between the three point. No, it's staying at 3.8, 3.892 right now. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. <laughs> 